on the hill? Where that uh, white type of structure? With a small red top? With the red top, got yes. it. So, you realize that there was a battle, there was a battle among the Europeans to have good trading posts, right? It's just like still the Europeans, or let's say the West, are still fighting among themselves in Congo. It now looks like as if it's the Congolese who are fighting, but it's not the Congolese, there are forces behind. Because the thing is, Congo has all the natural resources on Earth. So if these guys fight among themselves, they don't see the use of what they have. You now exchange your valuables for something that you don't really need. Uh -huh. Because they've been fighting for decades. I say, what's the UN doing about it? Because the powers manipulating the wars in Congo goes beyond the UN. That's because it. the more they fight among themselves, the richer these countries become. You know, because for, for the superpowers to fire their, their missiles, to, to move their jet fighters and all that, they need one essential thing, uranium. Congo is producing that. And now without, you see, I think without Congo, without Congo, maybe the world cannot use Self, mobile right. phones or laptops. That's right. They are getting levels of right. lithium right. and some other stuff from, from mm -hmm. there. Congo produces about 80% right. of those things in the world. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. But you know, Congo is a poor region. So that, those resources they had were supposed to enrich them, but it's making them poor. Yes, it's making them poor. So that is what exactly they did. The British built a fort to protect this area and this building from any attack from their competitors. So anything, those that will signal those here, they will arm the castle and defend it. So the British did everything in their blood to make sure that nobody would take their, their bread from them, yes. And there are churches also. How ironic the whole thing is. So, to your right, we have the Methodist Church, the first one in Ghana. We, across the street, we have the, in, the Church of England, the Anglican Church. And beyond it, we have the Catholic. So these, are the, these were the main churches we had this, in this country, Methodist, Catholic, and Anglican. And don't forget that the churches had their root in the castles. Dungeon, down, church. All right, sometime we're on top of the African Holocaust Dungeons, Cape Coast, the Castle Park, where the white devils enjoyed paradise while our people suffered in the dungeons.